Okay, this is an example of an if-else program in which the else is going to be a default uh, when we're using computer logic. And this is that uh, last test we had about getting uh, user input in the favorite movie. So I'm just going to expand upon that. So step one, I created a string to store what the user enters. I created my scanner so I can get input. I'm prompting the user to enter something. I'm storing whatever they type. This is just uh, final output. That's not necessarily required. Now with a string, if you recall, we do if user input, and because we're using words here, input to string, we use the word equals. So we have to use equals, not an equal sign. And you don't have to add this, but if you want to add ignore case, it won't care if it's capital or not. Star Wars. So now I don't have to worry about whether or not the user capitalizes that. Then you add another parenthesis to go with that one. So I have one, two, and one, two. And there's no semicolon, remember, because they use curly braces. So we have to start commenting these closing curly braces on if statements. This is the end of the activity or action. This is the end of the program. And I like to indent these just to make it more user friendly. So I'm going to copy this print statement. So, if the user enters Star Wars, I'm going to say, hey, mine too. Now, if the user were to type anything else, I can run this program and type in anything else. So I'm going to type in some nonsense, and then notice nothing will happen except this output down here. So if the user enters anything besides Star Wars, all it's going to do is show them this. This would be completely skipped. But if we want a logical default, what we can do is put in an else statement. And an else just looks like this. Now what's cool about an else is since it's a default, we don't need anything in parentheses. It doesn't have any conditions. And these two statements are, are completely linked. This if and this else go together. It's either or. Nothing can go between them. So do not separate them and put no code goes here. Otherwise, you'd split up that pair. So if you want a default, this is what we use. And it's only a default for this if. It's only an either or. If we had another if, this else wouldn't be tied to it. Oh, excuse me, this else. And I can copy something in that might say you have bad taste. All right, so I'm going to execute it. Most excellent movie. And it's working, it's working, it's working. All right, so it says I have bad taste and it's showing me back what I entered. If I were to run that again, if I typed anything but Star Wars, I'd get that same message. So I'm going to try Star Wars once again, should get a different message.
it gets too slow like this, you can turn off interactive and type your answer in the standard inputs up here. So because mine is going so slowly, I'm going to type star wars. And then when it goes to get the input from the scanner, it'll grab it from here. Cool. There we have it.